people's ears, noses, feeling that wind chill a little bit. So this is our field training expedition, so we're just going out overnight tonight and once we get out there we're going to test all our equipment, so set up the tent and uh, see how everything works so we've got a really good idea for once we actually get out in the field. I guess part of going out there as the camera crew is uh, we got to go through the same training as everybody else. So myself and Drew are trying to pay attention and trying to avoid the urge to take too many pictures because there'll be plenty of time for that I guess. So we're going to go sleep outside tonight. First time in Antarctica sleeping outside. True. Not the last. Once we've got this lash down, we'll just have a quick meeting in our little bay there with the whiteboard and go through a few checks, make sure that we've ticked every box, uh, we haven't forgotten anything vital, and then we'll uh, do a mass wander around to the sign out book around the front, uh, sign out for the night. Three in the back, one in the front. You're good to go. Let's roll. Well done. <laughs> Alright, so this is going to be our home for the night. Let's say this is our area here. I like to have my camp kind of in a nice, neat line going. Does that make sense? Alright. Which tender are you boys in? Can I come and have a quick look? Pretty cosy. Yeah. A couple of wee things for tonight. Uh -huh. That little um, cot in the top there is a really good spot to dry things out. So my socks will go straight up there. Do you strip down and put on a new layer? I I generally don't, depend on how many layers I've got left, because we're going to be very limited in terms of the number of polypros and yeah, things great. that we've got in there. So I will generally try and warm up before I go to bed. So I'll do all we do inside the tent, go to bed warm, and you'll stay a lot warmer and not quicker. Do you take your socks off? Take my socks off. Um, I sleep really hot, so I yeah. can't sleep with socks on. Some people would like to. Don't wear too many layers in your sleeping bag, because it's not going to help you. Yeah. You let the sleeping bag do the work. Do you wear a hat? I do wear a hat, yep. Yeah. Keeps the head warm. Also, quite often, if it's a really cold night, we'll have my neck gator on and ride up and around. Right. Um, you can use your hat as your, your good night zone and pull that over your eyes because you will find these quite light when the sun's blaring down on you. Is this as dark as it's going to get? And this is as dark as it's going to get. <laughs> 24 hours of sunlight. Home sweet home.